Happy Easter everyone! I recently met the lovely Elise from My Cupcake Addiction. She makes totally awesome cupcake and cake pop tutorials. She is so cool. I love her energy. I did her nails while she was down here in Melbourne. So if you guys want to see a sneak preview of my next week's design, go and watch her Easter videos and tell her I sent you. Without further ado, here comes my pocket animal nail art tutorial. As always, start with base coat to protect your nails, then a layer or two of a base color of your choice. Use a lighter shade of the same color family and draw a semicircle on the tip of the nail. I just used the brush that came with the bottle. Grab a detail brush and line all the edges to frame the design. Again, I'm keeping with the same color family here and used a darker green polish. To make the bottom section look more like a pocket, I'm going to add in some stitched lines to decorate around it. Now it's time for the cute little pocket animals. Since Easter is coming up, I decided to go with a bunny rabbit. I did come up with a few alternatives for different kind of animals you can put in your pocket. So it's up to you whether you want to occupy all your fingers with cute animals or you can do an accent nail with one animal of your choice. Then just have a stitched outline for the rest of your nails to complement the accent nail. So once you've drawn in the basic shape of the animals, Color in the ears and dot in the eyes. Don't forget to add a little button on top of the pocket. For the little kitty design, I just changed the shape of the head and added in some tiny pointy ears instead. I also decided to draw in a tail because it looked so much cuter. And if any of you have seen my Mari design, this looks kind of like the baby version of it. Same color and everything. <laughs> and then for the little cheeky monkey, I decided to go with the color scheme from one of my older videos I did of the morality monkeys. If you want to go visit that tutorial, you can click on the annotation or find the link in the description box below. Tell me which monkey is your favorite so I know if my skills have improved after 3 years. <laughs> and then there is the little pinky. Since the background color I went with is blue, it reminded me of Dumbo <laughs> for some reason. So I decided to draw in an elephant. And then after it came out, I thought, why does this look familiar? Then I realized the colors looked kind of similar to my Twilight Kitty nail design. Yeah, so I recycled some color schemes in this video, so I hope you don't mind. Anyway, so when you're finally done, add a layer of top coat to protect your masterpiece. If you like this video, please rate and add it to your favorite playlist. Please subscribe for updates. I upload new videos every Thursday. My videos are now on Pinterest, so feel free to repin onto your own boards for easy access. You can find all the links in the information bar below. Happy holidays, everyone.